Hello, hello, welcome back to another anime art video. My name is Dennis and I'm a beginner artist and in today's video I'm going to be drawing Cell, but not perfect Cell because this Cell was the Cell that was created by Jail. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> um, yeah, it, okay, let me ask people a question, okay? Cell has all the cells right he has everybody's cells he has goku vegeta piccolo so on and so on right so <laughs> one thing that kills me is right he's perfect cell well he's cell like the base cell like the only the, the way for him to get more power would be for him to absorb people but that's not the only way for him to get power he has two Saiyans inside of him. The cell of two Saiyans inside of him. So he can battle and get stronger off of that. Now imagine if he like like blows his body up, right? And then he heals from that damage. How much stronger he'd be. So what I'm saying is what he could have did was he could have he could have like trained, right? He could have battled more, gotten stronger from the damage that he healed from, and then seeked out the androids to absorb their power. And then when he powers up, nobody could stop him. You know? It's kinda weird that first thing he did was just go after like the immediate power boost, even though like, you know, and then even when he got, like, the ultimate power, he still, like, gave them chances to, like, power up. If Why didn't he practice while he was in that, that stage that he created? He created a stage for battle. But, like, he could have, you know, he could have did some, like, one-two training while he was in there. I mean, but I guess once you strive to get the best power, or not even strive to get the best power, once you perceive that you have the best power, because you sense that your power is above uh, everybody else around you, I guess you wouldn't really need to, uh, fight, like, or train at that point, depending on who you are, some people aren't, like, you know, they don't want to be stagnant in what they're capable of, so even if they reach that, t uh, upper, e uh, upper echelon of power, they are still thriving for more, because Goku and Vegeta, like, once they've gotten to be the strongest on their planet, like, you know, like, they still continue to fight, even though they're way stronger than everybody on Earth. It's just, like, a, they always feel as if, like, they can in better improve themselves. And until they get to the point where they stop advancing, they're not going to stop uh, fighting. And I'm trying to, right now, I'm trying to talk without biting my tongue because I bit my tongue earlier and now there's like a bump on the left side of my mouth and I keep biting it like as I'm talking I keep like like chipping at it on accident and I'm trying to not talk as much but it's hard to get a sentence out without actually chomping on it so right now you can hear that I kind of changed my voice the tone well not the tone but like certain like it sounds like I have a lisp because I'm putting my tongue in the top of my mouth like and keeping it connected there so it's impossible for me to bite my tongue when it's up there and I only decided to do that after I bit my tongue like three or four times as I was talking so uh let's get into this
Show me. 
with this picture of cell I think that this form of cell is very interesting I think it's also interesting that like the pod like how how much time changed you know like the pod of cell like he came back to the past but would we say do we think that this cell would have fared better in the future or would he have would he you know have fared better better in the past you know it's kind of complicated don't you think the fact that this cell got to its perfect form and then you know got mopped but if he were in the future he would have stood a better chance because if he would have absorbed the two androids android 17 and 18 it would have you know would have been a different ball game because there wouldn't have been anybody there to stop him but then, you know, I guess he got kind of, I don't know if I would say he got greedy or what the situation was. Maybe him in his base form wasn't strong enough. And that's why he was like absorbing like regular humans. Maybe um, regular humans got him to a point where he actually, you know, felt as if he could absorb 17 and 18. Because 17 and 18 base strength is like, you know, far beyond what he was capable of when he first hatched, I guess. So maybe that was the reason. But if there are humans in the future, then I don't see why he wouldn't just stay there. But uh, that's it for this video. If you liked it, be sure to leave a like, subscribe. If you didn't, let me know what I can do in the comment section to make it better for you to watch next time. The glove is off. Peace, love, thanks for watching.